Hello and welcome to the show. So we're here on GTA 5 for another challenge. Now this wasn't the challenge which I had planned for today. There was some problems. Basically, I'm not sure what happened, but my audio from a video managed to fall out of sync with the video and it's completely useless. So can't use, can't do that one today. Uh, this is a kind of a last minute uh, idea which I had and I'm recording this quite late. Um, so if I fall asleep halfway through, that's what's going on. And um, yeah, everything went wrong basically with the video that we'd planned. But that will happen next week, hopefully. My challenge uh, today is to airlift this dumper truck, if I can get the Chinook in place, to the top of Mount Chiliad and then survive the drive down. That's what I'm going to try and do. Now, I'm not going to try and drive the dumper truck up Mount Chiliad. Even if it is possible, I don't want to spend a year of my life trying to get it up there. I'm fairly sure it probably won't do it. It's, I will, um, I'm tempted to say it would be impossible to do. I think that the dumper truck's just not powerful enough. I mean, it, well, so I tell a lie. It's got lots and lots of power and an awful lot of torque, but I have a sneaking suspicion that uh, it won't go up the mountain. Uh, it's too heavy, is what I would guess. And now... I have got to be incredibly careful with flying with this thing. For those of you who watched my Will It Roll, I'll oh, stop moving about. Um, who watched my Will It Roll with uh, GTA cars, I was airlifting this and the bulldozer around. And what happens is, as you saw there, once the truck starts wobbling, uh, it gets caught under the wheels of this Chinook, and then it starts dragging the helicopter around, and then you are in an awful lot of trouble. I, you can just lose complete and utter control of the helicopter and go flying into the mountainside. I have done many a times when trying to airlift this dump truck long distances. So I am being extra, extra cautious. Uh, it's going to take a little while to get to the top of the mountain. I hope, yes, there's a mountain over there. There's the big mountain and there's another one over there somewhere and there's some sort of small mountains over there. Yes, I'm, I am aiming for the right mountain. I really hope so. I've never tried to airlift anything to the top of Chiliad, so I don't know how well this is going to work or how long it is going to work. I'm also astonished that a, a Chinook would be able to pick up, uh, or a helicopter like this should not be able to pick up a humongous, humongous dump truck. <laughs> it's just a, a utterly, utterly ridiculous sight, this one. Ooh, fighting the camera while trying to fly. Not a good idea, but... Ooh, I don't want to... Well, if I go into the sea, I might survive, but then I'd have to go and get a new helicopter and find a new dump truck for all of this. I really don't want to crash on the way there, at least. Now, I am doing this in single player for the many reasons, in fact. First of all, you don't have the free roam full brigade, as Husky likes to call them, uh, going around shooting everybody, but more because uh, you can buy a cargo bob, which is what this thing is, uh, in single player. It costs a million and a half, or two, oh, I can't remember. It costs quite a lot of money, but you can buy one. What is that? Is that a duster just taken off? I think it might have been. I don't think I've ever seen one of them in single player, unless you'd, you might fly one in a mission or something. But, uh, oh yeah, so there is. That's from the little airfield, airfield bit over there. Now we are actually getting towards Chiliad, so I better start climbing. And hopefully I can not smear the thing into the into the mountain. But, uh, yeah, I'm using uh, single player because you can actually buy a cargo bob on here. And it's not going to take you many, many weeks to earn the money. I think they do spawn in some, some locations in multiplayer. If you're a high enough level, I think they spawn at the air airport and possibly at the military base although it's always risky trying to get into there also on multiplayer this dump truck is a million dollars you cannot find them elsewhere as far as i'm aware i've checked the quarry a few times never seen one so i presume you can only buy the dump truck and a million dollars on here is an awful 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 lot of money it is really very very expensive um, it takes a long time to get that kind of money on the online stuff on, while I'm on the subject of online, there is supposed to be this stimulus stimulus package uh, arriving at some point. I don't know if anybody actually knows when, uh, when everybody's going to be getting half a million dollars. Um, yeah, I don't. Does anybody anybody like to inform me? Is there any, uh, I guess, kind of closer to a re well, not say a release date, but uh, yeah, does anybody know when that's supposed to be coming? I I heard it was possibly by the end of the month. But I uh, don't really know. What's going to happen is everybody is all of a sudden going to have the expensive houses or an expensive car of some sort. I, d um, I don't know if I'm a massive fan of, of doing that as such. I mean, sure, I, I appreciate that, you know, they held their hands up and said, yep, we made a mistake. This is how we're going to um, 
I guess, repay you, but it kind of diminishes the, the hard-earned money that uh, some people have been made. That people have made. You know, if everybody suddenly got half a million, uh, half a million doesn't become as as a much of an achievement, I guess. But they, are, I personally, I don't think they really needed to apologise so much as they. <laughs> They always knew it was going to crash when you try and put that many people on. And yeah, they, they, their hands were tied when it came to releasing the online bit of this game. But uh, yeah, I, I do look forward to the extra money. I might actually be able to afford a helicopter uh, in sensible amount of time. I've still, oh, I thought that was plummeting towards the mountainside completely out of control for a second there. Uh, but no, I do still have control of my helicopter. Now this is the tricky bit. I now have to land the dump truck and I... Oh god, I've got to be really careful with this. Don't smear it across the ground. Don't smear it across the ground. I was ignoring my own advice. Uh, come on. <laughs> it's The helicopter is rather less responsive when there is a big dump truck dangling below it. That is a true fact. Now, I want to place the chopper, or place the dump truck about here. Oh no. Oh no. Not about here. Not about here. Things have gone wrong. Things have gone wrong. Emergency! Can I try and pick it up again? Um, no, come back, dump truck. Oh, dear. Oh, bugger it. Um, we we might have a, a small... Uh, God damn it. Um, I got the truck all the way there, and... Uh, I will be a minute, I think. To go and find another one. Okay, so I am kind of back. Um, I've <laughs> got another blooming dump truck all the way to the mountain. I'm now just kind of having a, having a bit of a look, trying to figure out a, a way down. I'm having a feeling that I'm not going to be uh, sort of going down off a, off well, kind of a track. There is a very narrow mountain bike pass there that does look quite fun, or dirt bike pass. Uh, either one does look kind of interesting although I don't think I'm going to fit a dump truck uh, down there it's a little bit too narrow so I think my, my main options are to either go down the path uh, the path that I've that we I normally ascend a mountain on uh, over from that direction and that is the easiest uh, way up and go down the other way but there are some really tight twisty turns that uh, we have been caught out on before and had crashes on uh, so that might not be the greatest idea uh, ever. There's also a narrow... T is, it, is there a tunnel that way? Or am I thinking of somewhere else? I think there's a tunnel that way as well. Well, actually, mm, there might be... I um, can't remember uh, <laughs> the area well enough. Uh, there is some deer. Is that some deer over there? I think it is. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not actually sure what the best way to approach it is. Both... Both sort of mountain bike trails, I guess, down each side get narrow at some point, which is a bit problematic for uh, for this dump truck. I could try to just go off the trails and try and find a route down on my own that's a little bit safer. However, that's likely to be very, very steep, and once this thing gets going, it's unlikely to stop, and I'll just roll down the mountain and eventually explode like the last goddamn dump truck is. Now, I'm not going to make the same mistake I did last time, I'm not going to put it on a surface that looked flat and actually wasn't. Um, I do not want to have to do this again. It is a nightmare flying this helicopter with a goddamn dump truck underneath you. And I also hope that the fuzz don't get angry at me. Oh, uh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Come on, recover, don't get caught up. Do not get caught up. Do not get caught underneath. There we go. It's very hard judging the height. It's hard enough judging the height from this kind of angle as it is, let alone with a goddamn dump truck underneath you. Uh, okay, what we want to do is uh, not quite go in that much. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you've got to do quite a lot of compensating for this massive thing that is pulling you down. And uh, I'm, I'm not really a pilot particularly, but never mind. Okay, so we want to put the dump truck here and not have it move around. There we go. You see, I was expecting the handbrake to go on on the first time where I, when I put it down. I may have knocked a hiker over. I do apologise. I am sorry for that, but it is your own silly fault if you were standing around while a Chinook airlift a dump truck in front of you. If I saw that coming, I would run or just get out of the way. I wouldn't stand nearby. I mean, I'd watch but from, from a safe distance. Okay, we are here. We are at the top of the mountain. 
The dump truck hasn't fallen down this time. And uh, I may have only run over one hiker. That's a good start. That is a good start to the to the day. And just as we're going to set off, I think the sun is starting to set. What is the time? Uh, we might be able to get it done. Right, now, what route am I going to take down? That's got to be the safest route, I think. I think that's too steep, and that way gets too twisty. I don't think the tunnel is on this bit. I'm getting places confused. Okay. I don't know if the dump trucks, if you can manoeuvre the dump trucks, um, if they roll over. I presume it acts the same as every other vehicle, but uh, I don't know for sure. I do know there are a few narrow points on this route. There may come a time when I have to just bail and just go down the mountain on its own. Because I, I know there are some very, very narrow <laughs> passes with this thing. And, ooh, come on. Oopsie. Um... Don't tell me I've got it blooming stuck already. I want to go over that way. I want to go that way, truck. Please allow me to go this way. Here we go. Look at that. I think I've bullsed it up completely already because it's going to want to go down there. And uh, no, come on. Come on. Use all of the torques. All of the torques. Oh, buggerations. We, do, we, are in, we are in trouble and we haven't left the starting area, really. Well, we have got a little bit way down. Oh, dear. This isn't going to go so well. Okay, I'm going to aim for this bit up here and hope and pray and beg that it'll work. Come on! Go, dump truck! Be good off-road! Be good off-road! You are good off-road. Thank you very, very much. That is very useful. Yes, run for your life. Uh, I think that's the wolfy things. We are here. We are here and we are... Oh, God. Yeah, this is a little bit narrow. Just a... Just a tiny... <laughs> bit narrow. Dear God. Okay, yeah, we're, we are here. We have not fallen off the mountain yet, even despite the truck's best efforts. It is sliding around. <laughs> yep, we're good. Ah, look at this. Nice wide piece of terrain I don't have to worry about falling off of. This next bit I do have to worry about falling off, off of. Off, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's an English sentence. Uh, oh, good. Yeah, this gets really, really narrow. Uh, come on, squeeze, breathe in. Breathe in, maybe it'll work. And you've got a little bit too much speed up on the brakes. I have really, if this thing starts getting carried away, uh, what way is better to go down? Um, don't know. Well, I've, the truck's gone this way. There's nothing I can do <laughs> about it anymore. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be really careful not to let this truck run away, as it is very big, very heavy, and will take a lot to get it stopped. It'll have an awful, awful lot of momentum if it starts tumbling down there. So yeah, I've got to be I've got to be a little bit careful uh, to make sure that I can actually keep this thing under control. I think I may have splattered something, uh, or no, maybe not. I think it's just got back up. Uh, never mind. Uh, no, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Brakes are on. Come on, please get slowed down. Um, okay, well we've gone off course, but that doesn't matter. I'm not trying to use the brakes as a sort of anchor to get it turned, and it has sort of worked don't believe it we survived that little scare well we are now completely off route and I'm having to hope that this doesn't get too steep so the truck oh good god there are trees and there are rocks and I want to go down this bit and we're on three wheels <laughs> in a however many oh tree oh dear I'm sorry tree and the tree doesn't move at all <laughs> however many tons this dump truck weighs and the tree doesn't care uh, no come on don't lose control don't lose control of the truck Yep, we are just about... I think we're actually getting towards civilization, Sort of. This has not been a bad way down. Uh, oh, no. Oh, many a tree. I think we can fit through here. Let's try not to roll it, though. Ooh, no, no, tree! Oh, dear. No, don't you dare get wedged, truck. Don't you even dare get wedged after all this. After It's probably taken me longer to get the damn thing here than it will to get me to get the thing out of here. I think we are completely wedged though. I don't think we're going to get free. Because uh No, we're not going to oh, maybe I might be able to rock it out of there possibly. Ah come on Come on please truck please just please be kind to me. Please be oh, I think we I think we are <laughs> this massive massive dump truck is going to be scuppered by that tree, and it's only by a tiny, tiny amount. Um, I need to think of a way of moving it. Can we? I don't think we can. Oh no! Don't think we can call up 
a, a heli like them have it deliver the helicopter to me. I'm presuming we can't do that. No, we can't. We can call a cab. Yes, that'll do. That'll be useful, I think. Um, hmm. I don't think we can do anything about it. I think the truck is well and truly wedged. Let's just try again. Let's just try a... Can you not even climb in it now? Why can you not climb into the truck? Oh, I've smeared myself on a tree. Fantastic. Oh, why are you not letting me get back in the vehicle? I wanted to... Oh, no, don't go down there. That is a really quite scary sight. I will be honest. If we can get a good view. <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a terrifying sight. Come on. Can we go actually underneath the... Yes, we can. <laughs> um, is there a way? Is there going to be any way at all of getting in this vehicle? And jump. We can't even climb on the back. Oh, dear. That's not gone to plan. Uh, we're going to slide down the hill. I, I really think that... The... No, get up, you moron. Oh, I died. How did that kill me? Have I died? No, I haven't died. What? Uh, oh, I, I must have clicked this one of the sticks in, or both the sticks in by accident when I was mashing buttons trying to get up. I thought I'd die for a minute, but I don't think I can get in the truck. I just don't think he's going to let me in. And uh, Nope, don't jump that way, you moron. Over this way. Yes, we're going to go up that way. Nope. <laughs> you can't even climb on it. Well... It's been an unmitigated failure, this mission of getting a dump truck down the side of Mount Chiliad. It, it's really not worked very well. Ah, oh, god damn it. I can't believe we had scuppered by a goddamn tiny tree. And I can't get the truck free. It is completely wedged in there. Well, there we go. That is it for this video, guys. So thank you very much for watching. How far away were we from civilization? We really weren't that... Uh, well, we weren't that far. If we got past that tree, it would have been fine. God damn it. Uh, <laughs> anyway, yeah, that is it for today, guys. So thank you very much for watching. As ever, if you have challenges you'd like to see us do in GTA or any other game, then please do let us know in the comment section. I'll have a look through, and our favourites will be in a video at some point. However, until next time, goodbye.